So, I guess this is a bit of a landmark, hitting triple figures. I started making videos in early 2011, and this is still my original channel. Here I am almost, but not quite nine years later, the better part of a decade. Video 1000, total online gas bag confirmed. At some point, maybe next year, I will set up a second channel, do another project. I do have an idea in mind, but I'll still keep using this channel. To what degree, I'm not sure. Probably just when I feel like putting something out there, which is all this channel ever has been. It's a mixed bag of me, I like to think. But I'm not going to get nostalgic or anything about this, because that's not me. It's not. So, when I first started pointing a camera at myself, I didn't have an idea of how long I wanted to do this. And I wasn't really asking myself any difficult questions. Questions like, can I do this? Is my voice a valid one? Again, that's not me. I think I was unemployed at the time back in January 2011, so I had some spare time on my hands and I had a few things to get off my chest. I can remember making a few videos about the UN and the concept or desirability of world government, things that interest me, not for everyone. If you're thinking about starting up a channel but are having doubts regarding the subject matter, for what it's worth I would advise that this, YouTube, is now an enormous platform. There is bound to be some audience for whatever you've got to say, large, medium or small, whatever you want to speak about. And also, don't concern yourself so much with what others think. Be selfish, selfish in a good way, and do it for you. Express yourself, do your thing. I've heard it said before that YouTube channels of a certain type, as in those set up to make money, or stir a bit of controversy, or just those that try to jump on a bandwagon, think anti-feminism, but don't hit the desired heights or the desired subcount. Channels like this tend to have a shelf life. Maybe the creator deletes the account eventually as it slides into irrelevance, only to be replaced by new edgelords fresh to the fight, and keen to game the system. I've heard that said, and observed some truth in it, yes, but some channels turn into monsters beyond the wildest dreams one imagines of those who originally set out with this goal or that. For me, this has always been a pastime, never about making a living. I do that elsewhere. I shoot videos because I enjoy expressing myself. I don't have a grand goal on this little channel. And the fact that it is little doesn't really concern me. But, hey, if people want to subscribe, I'll be glad to have you. Peace.